Hi everyone, come take a seat. Go and get a brew, even if it's cold. All right, I'm a comfort, no. I've got back eight. Oh, just, whew. let's try this. Oh, that's not bad, is it? There we go, nailed it. How's that look? That's not bad, is it? Kind of. Anyway, how are you? I hope you're all right. Like I said, come get a drink. Yeah, I just, I don't feel very, I don't know. I don't know, do you know what? I went Tesco. I went Tesco, right? Walked out of Tesco, all right, and the security guard, all right, he went, and I went, thank you. What am I thanking him for? Tell me. Thank you. I walked out going, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> what are you thanking the security guard for? And all right, we're just on your right, you know. I felt like a knob. I did. I felt like a right knob. Anyway, I've been sent um, a few bits from a brand called Olive Norma. They got in touch and asked if I'd like to um, work with them, collaborate with them, um, show you what I got, give my honest review of these items. So, yeah, I'm going to show you the bits that I've got. So Olive Norma um, specialise in everything crystal related and crystal energy and you know they their website is very helpful you know with every um, you know item that they sell they say what it's about what it does you know the energy that it gives off and you know they've got all sorts on there and I picked a few items so I'm gonna um, show you those. This is my favourite thing ever and this is a natural moonstone healing protection ring and i got it in a size 11 so this comes in this box this really pretty little box and honestly this is my favorite thing comes in this really nice little velvet drawstring bag and honestly it is stunning it's so nice so i'm gonna pop it in here so you can see it honestly the way it glimmers is so nice so when my camera focuses come on and there we go it is such a nice ring look at that it looks really nice and it fits really nice as well so yeah i am chuffed with that so that is my favorite it also sent me this green aventurine bangle i think that's how you say it aventurine and i really like i mean i do really like it but i really liked it like <laughs> i really liked it on the website i'm not sure if i'm 100 percent convinced now um i'm not sure if i like um the metal but i i really like the stone i'm just not sure if i like um the metal so yeah you know it's just my honest opinion but i really like um you know the the crystal and i just yeah i think it's a very pretty looking um bracelet it's quite a chunky bracelet as well so yeah that is the bracelet this one is a rose quartz like adjustable um bracelet you can see there we go which is really nice like with the, the tie bit there that you can adjust so that is a rose quartz like handmade um little bracelet and this i absolutely love the only thing is it's a lot smaller than i thought it was going to be so i have seen these um i think the picture can be a little bit deceiving so i have seen these um quite big like a large one it's a little cat shelf but it is quite a small one um i still really like it i just think it's very small um but it comes in these two pieces so you just pop that in there it's got the attachment on the back and look that is adorable that is absolutely adorable. I think it's a really nice little shelf and it'll add a nice little bit of detail. Like I said, it's just a lot smaller than I thought it would be. But yeah, my favorite is the ring. Absolutely love the ring. That is Olive Normal. Like I said, I will link them below. They specialize in, you know, a lot of crystals. Like I said, um, like tapestries, um, shelving and stuff like that. So yeah, I'll pop them below along with discount code. Um, so yeah, obsessed, obsessed with the ring. I have been down the charity shops. All right, I've got two bags, two bags to show you off. So listen, let me show you this first. All right, bargain. So I seen one of these last year at a car boot sale and I thought, you know what? I really like it, but I never got it. You never like, look at summer and think, right, I'll come back to you. You never do, get home and you gutted. All right, absolutely gutted. Well, that was me last year. I really wanted this like fur gilet, body warmer. So yeah, I seen this 
and it was three quid. I didn't think it was going to be three quid because this charity shop's usually quite priced there. And this is by David Emmanuel. David Emmanuel in a size 18. It almost sounds designer. Let's have a look. Let me see. Well, anyway, it was advertised at £6.50 originally. Oh, 16 16 I keep seeing that. I keep seeing that. Let's have a look. Let's have a look what that means. I keep seeing it. Also, the biggest one for me that I see all the time, and I'm going to get it tattooed on there, is 10 10. I see, all the time, 10 10. Every time I look at the time, 10 10. You know, I just see it everywhere. 1616. Oh my god, I've just typed 1616 in there. You know, like some of the options, it says angel number pregnant, sir. Oh my god, seeing the number 1616 is a sign that a new or renewed love is about to happen in your life. New beginnings are a special time. <sighs> I wish, I wish, I wish, I wish. David Emmanuel, I've um, been looking at Macaroo and Incitol, is it Incitol? I've been doing a lot of research, uh, research and polycystic ovaries, a lot of research. And um, yeah, oh, David Emmanuel is a Welsh fashion designer. Nothing crazy, you get it on eBay for about 20 quid. But this is the um, jacket and I love it. Well, body, warm, but the body warmer and I think it's really nice. And this is definitely, I mean, it, it does smell a bit funky, but am I going to try it on? Yes, I am. All right. It do, I will do a proper try on. Oh, is she? All right. This is a bit snazzy. When are we younger? I'm 18. Go on. Do better than that. When are we younger? All right. I had this coat from River Island. It was a fur, full fur coat. Okay. Well, it was a cropped like, style, you know, but it was fully furry. <laughs> Fucking Stacey Slater had it on EastEnders, didn't she? Couldn't believe it. Could not believe it. I was absolutely over the moon. I was so happy. I was going around telling everyone me and Stacey wear the same same coat. But anyway, this is really nice. So yeah, always check the pockets. Nothing. But it was three quid. That's a bargain, you know? So, right, that's the first thing. But I am going to do a try on. So, not today. I'm not going to do it today. I'll get another one. Oh, excuse me. Right, I lack in PJs. So I got myself some PJ bottoms. These were a quid. And they are from, um, well, I don't know. Oh, yeah, I do. Where are they from? Pep and Co, size 12 to 14, but they're stretcher, all right. So they say sweet dreams on them. And I, it's always bottoms. It's always bottoms that I lack in. So I thought for a quid, you know, I'm gonna get them. And then I got this new look, um, I love this. Look at that. That is nice. Look. Oh, new look. Little pink number. Elasticated there. You know. I just thought, hey, up. That's quite nice. The school run with some joggers. Eh, yeah, that's not bad, is it? And then I got Tyler some shorts. So, some little denim shorts. They are 13 to 14, but you can adjust the waist. So, I'm trying to look for some nice summery bits. I am going to buy some summery bits, um, TK Maxx and Primark, you know. I want to get them some nice, like, floral shirts to go on holiday and stuff. So, yeah, I got these, which were a pound, and I thought they were in really nice condition. So, I grabbed them. I also grabbed Tyler these um, skinny jeans, which are a size 12 to 13. I don't know where they're from. They just say skinny fit denim. They're really nice. They're really nice quality and like the tag like is really nice as well but they're just really good condition black skinny jeans and they're only a pound so yeah I grabbed them then then this I wasn't sure about but I thought you know what it is a bit of me but is it I don't know but I've seen it and I was drawn to it so it's like old style Primark in a size 16 it's like probably from ages ago but I really liked it I don't know what with, but it's this really nice, um, like ribbed, like collared top. So yeah, I just thought that was really nice. So I grabbed that and that was only a pound. And then onto my last bag, took everything out of the bag because it's doing me head in. I've got a few games. I love little hand games like this, just really easy. So this one is Name the Emoji, and it's a flashcard game, movie edition. They're only a quid, they're literally like a quid each. So yeah, I love it. So let's play. Name the movie. <gasps> Name the mover. 
Come on. E.T. That's E.T. My mum's got um, a little card. So when I was younger, I went to the space centre. You got to have a photo of E.T. And honestly, E.T. was my childhood. I cried and cried over that film. I wanted to have E.T. My mum will tell you, like, she, I would just be crying all the time because I wanted to look after E.T. And yeah, it, it just... Yeah, I love E.T. All right, let's do another chicken run come on that was only a quid pretty much brand new and then i got this one which is 10 clues so the quick thinking who what where mystery game you get 80 cards in here let's do one that'll be me if i ever go live i'm glad you want to play a game <laughs> let's play a game the answer is at the bottom okay right name this thing i'm gonna say it okay like the the, the, the clues okay steve's gonna love this game i'm a term of affection and sometimes a name, I'm a crystal, find me in beer or cane, I give energy, I'm white or brown, I can rot teeth, put me on your cereal or in your coffee, or are you sweet enough? And it's sugar. So that's amazing. I love games like this. And then catchphrase, I love catchphrase. Honestly, we have a competition when it's on the teller. And then these were 50p, all right? They are good for nothing. Good for nothing, black joggers. I buy this brand, Good for Nothing, and it's such a good brand. Like Tyler's coat, he's got this coat, right? And it's really thick, it's by Good for Nothing, and it's really thick, good quality. It's got like fur around the side, really nice on the arm and stuff. It's proper nice and heavy, like it's a really thick coat. And these joggers are like proper nice condition as well. So yeah, I was well chuffed when I seen these, 50p for Good for Nothing joggers. So yeah, I got Mason them. And then, right, I found this top. I'm not sure if it's going to fit, but it's by um, Stradivar Stradivarius. It's a size medium, and it's a bedtime top, but I really like it. I think it's a bed top anyway. It says, love yourself first. And I just think, like, you know. And then I got this, which is by Pretty Little Thing. It was 50p in the kids' section, but it was a size 16, 50p. And it's not washed out or anything. I got a little vest top which was on the 50p rack, although I think she charged me a pound for it, but you know, you can't complain, can you? I'm not gonna go missing here, bitch. Take 50p off that, all right? I got that on the fucking sale rail. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, just, I love little basic tops like this, little strappy tops, you know? This was on the 50p rail as well. And I just thought, I'm, you know, I'm thinking summer. So it's a size medium from Sheen and it's just a little, a little floaty top, you know? With some, do you know what I'm thinking? Red lip and high-waisted denim jeans and some nice little sandals. And then the last thing that I got is this brand new Boohoo Man top, which was a pound, but I'm gonna wear it for bed. It's in a size medium. And it says, like it's all brand new look, and it says um, limited edition in pink, and it's quite long, so I'm just gonna wear it for bed. Do you know what I mean? Quite comfy. I love t-shirts for bed. That is everything um from this charity shop haul so yeah i'm quite impressed with all my bits and bobs that i got especially the joggers as always my friends don't let any kids get you down you my friend are fucking amazing all right know it i love you and i'll see you in tomorrow's video